Okay, guys, we're here for our second interview of the press conference, and uh, we were unable to uh, get one of our fighters here. But we had a little bit of a situation, um, and we're going to talk. get right into that. We're going to bring in uh, the opponent that he fought in the last round, and we're also going to bring in the commissioner. So without further ado, let's give it up for Commissioner Petey and Vix Bombers. Thank you. All right, so uh, Commissioner Petey, um, I'm going to get right into the, the situation. So last time we had a press conference, and uh, we were interviewing a couple of fighters that were doing a rematch, and then something happened. Uh, tell us what happened. We are talking about when he came in here? Yeah. Oh, man. So we had 3-6 come in here. We did, had no idea he was even going to be here. And he decided to come in, flapping his mouth, talking all sorts of crazy mess. Um, we just weren't going to allow that. He comes in here talking all this mess. He's got no opponent. Um, he's saying he's the best boxer around. The first thing he needs to do is secure an opponent to come into here and to box with us. Yeah, and we'll show you some of that footage right here. So if we can show it now, we will right here. And, um, yeah, you just came in and just, like, disrupted the whole thing, right? Yeah, we were right yeah. in the middle of uh, doing our interviews, and he came in. And um, so with that, Commissioner Petey stripped him of his belt and his title, and right now he doesn't have an opponent. And speaking of opponents... We got Vix Bombers here, and in the last round, Vix, uh, you faced him for the three rounds in the hot box. Yes, sir. Uh, what was your experience? How do you feel the fight was? Do you feel like it was uh, that he deserved the win? I feel, uh, you know, it was a little different. Um, it was definitely uh, hard, like balancing out, you know, in, inside of the ring with the with the smoke and everything. Everybody is a little confused. It's their first time. Um, he gave it his all, but I still feel like, you know, your boy came harder. Yeah, <laughs> you know and some people yeah. are saying that, you know what mm -hmm. I mean? And uh, we couldn't get you in on a rematch for this one, um, but... Uh, Which we know, you know. We really know. <laughs> we know what? <laughs> what do we know? Well, we, oh, we know who really won. 3-6, <laughs> we know who won. So he's saying, you're saying you really think you won that fight for sure? That sounds oh, yeah. like a rematch. Oh, yeah. That sounds I mean, like he's calling somebody out. To it me. does sound a bit like a rematch, and that's kind of part of the reason why I wanted to bring this in. Um, he's been stripped of his title. You know, there's this whole situation going on with him, and then there is a bit of controversy regarding your guys' fight, and, and was it fair? So, and, and it was our first time, so maybe we missed something. Um, and so that's the question we're putting out there. That's why you guys are here today. And that's what we're here to talk about. So, Commissioner Petey, um, how do you feel about um, the legalities? Would would you be willing to allow a rematch um, with 3-6 and VIX? I absolutely think it's a possibility, but I definitely want 3-6 to get his shit together. If he comes in here into the hot box boxing ring, he needs to come in with respect. And he needs to know that we don't play no games here. So if he's going to bring it, he needs to bring it correctly. And he needs to come in with respect. There you have it. And Vix, if if the uh, opportunity came about where uh, a rematch was an option, what are your thoughts and will you accept the fight? Oh, I'm ready. I'm ready already. I've been I've been ready for the next one. Yeah, if he's on, I'm with it. All right, well, there you have it. My phone is ringing. Uh, in the meantime, maybe you guys can hear it. Is it 3-6? And that's probably because we got to go get ready for our... It might be 3-6. He might be watching this right now. Let me see. Let me see. Let me just check. I should have just checked. Was that 3-6 that called me? Um, no, okay. It was not 3 Well, actually, it could have been 3-6. All right, so missed calls. Nope. It was a political call. Of course, <laughs> you know, get five of those a day. So uh, with that, guys, uh, I, I, I'm pretty sure we got an after party to get to, right? So we're going to the Lexi Absolutely. tonight. We're going to do a costume party. We're getting it for uh, Halloween. Tattoos and, just and so you, smoke. Yeah, and just so you guys know, uh, if you are out there, we will be at the Lexi for the rest of the night. And anybody who comes through is going to get buy one, get one free tickets for hot box boxing but you wow. got to come find us and buy it in hand yep we're doing it at the booth all night at the lexi come find us gentlemen thanks for coming and talking uh, mr Petey. absolutely thank, thank you for your kind words my pleasure thank you brother. for allowing us to be yeah, here absolutely i appreciate you guys and i appreciate the community here give it up for yourselves and these guys here absolutely